So I'm here with Chris and Alan from EdgeTech. Some have dubbed them the Ant and Deck of the Fit Show. <laughs> I'm about to find out large. why. <laughs> yeah, middle and large is probably the truer definition. Well, Ant and Deck, I'll go with. So welcome to the Fit Show. It's actually your first time. So what first have you heard about EdgeTech. the show? No, it's first time for EdgeTech. I've, I've been okay. in the IG industry for about 20 years, but this is the first time for, for EdgeTech. Oh, I see. Right, so you have experience with the Fit Show. What yeah, is it particularly about this show that you enjoy? Why do you think it's so important to the industry? Well, I think it's it's now the, the UK show for the fenestration industry. And it's grown significantly. We're moving to glass uh, to the NEC next year. Oh, um, big news. Big news. And, and EdgeTech have always been a, a supporter of the show. And we're one of the first people to to commit to the show. Uh, it's been very good for us over the, over the years. And this year we're moving from our traditional IG industry, which people know as for spacer bars, into more for the window and fenestration industry. So we have a, a range of products for the fabricators and installers now as well. So some exciting things yeah. on the horizon. Alan, you've been to Fit Show many, many times. What is it you most enjoy about this show? Well, I'm, I'm an ever present. Um, <laughs> we were here in 2013 and 14. Um, this year I think it's excelled itself. Um, when the, the first one took place, we had a, a double-decker stand, and that was, like, revolutionary. And uh, now they've all got them, haven't they? Um, now look at you. The, the stands are amazing, um, and there's a lot of people coming through the door, so it, it's great stuff. Um, as Chris said, it's the show for the fenestration industry. And we're actually, our core business, if you like, is the insulated glass industry, but we're here with products that appeal to fabricators and installers as well. So it's a, a branch out into new areas for us. Um, the core stays the same, still very, very strong, but we've got new and exciting things to, to tell people about as well. So tell us about those. There was a seamless link there, Alan, wasn't there? Tell us about your exciting products that you've got here to showcase at Fit Show. Well, we've got a product called TrueFit, and for some years now, we, the industry's been improving the performance of windows. We have a, an energy rating scheme where windows are rated A to G. So consumers now are, are used to spending their hard-earned cash on windows that perform very well, but no attention has been paid to the installation. So you can buy a high-performing window. If it's not fitted really well and sealed really well, you've wasted your money because all your heat energy is going to escape around the perimeter. So we have TrueFit, which is a, a very simple, um, expanding, insulating foam that goes around the perimeter of the window frame and is literally a warm edge for windows. So you maintain that performance that you've paid for. And from an installer point of view, it's incredibly quick and clean and you can use it in all weathers. And I honestly think one day most windows will be fitted this way. Okay, so, um, well, you touched upon it there. It's kind of a glimpse as to what we can expect. There's lots of innovation there, isn't there? Everybody's showcasing these very exciting products. Have you had a chance to take a look around, see what other people are doing? What have you got your eye on? Not yet. I mean, we've, we've literally started and it's been, we've been very busy all morning. So it's been, a, it's been a great start to the show for us. And Thursday, I've put some time aside to go around and meet people within the industry. Um, for me, it's a great show to meet people that we've known for many, many years, either customers or potential customers. So... Um, yeah, it, 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 the Fit Show really has become the voice of the industry, the exhibition for the industry. Ooh, they like that one. That was a good sound bite. But it's very true, isn't it, as well? And you, you touched upon it there. But um, it really is a great place to meet competitors, see what they're doing, making sure that you're ahead of the game, that you're doing something a bit different. But ultimately, because you know, you're obviously paying for a stand to be here, you're going to get lots of sales leads and generations. Has that been the case in the past? Talk us through some of the positive things that you've experienced from previous years. It's certainly been the case in the past. It'll be the case again this year. But I think there's more to it than that. This is an industry that's that's matured. It's an industry that's having a resurgence in ideas. I mean, all the systems boys are here. They've all got something new and exciting. So many new products. People have pushed the boat out on stand designs. Even some of the smaller stands that may be simpler are fantastic. Um, you look at the Miele stand just through there with their trees, with their, their coloured hand. Absolutely awesome. So I think there's there's a celebration aspect to this as well and, and maybe the industry saying you know it's it's okay to get together and just celebrate the good things so of course we're all here for new business but i think we're also here to say look look what we've achieved look what you've achieved and so gala dinner tomorrow night should be very special you looking forward to it you patched have you patched your sequin frock are we ready, yeah, ready to go frocks and high heels and <laughs> I'm, I'm wearing them now actually so. no no yeah we're ready to go aren't we I'm stay away from that issue. Yeah. <laughs> I told you, I'm not comfortable with trans and gendered. Yeah. On a serious note, though, I mean, the awards dinner is going to be a big deal, isn't it? Yes. It's a real celebration, a pat on the back, and a chance to see what other people are doing and kind of feel very valued for that. Um, are you looking forward to it? Are you guys up for any awards? 
No, we're not up for any awards. Uh, we won the G15 awards, we got some awards there, so uh, not for this time, but no, it, for me, it's all about networking. Tomorrow evening is all about networking and, and enjoying ourselves, having a good time. You know, we, these sort of things are hard work. So it's a great um, opportunity to sit down with valued customers and friends from within the industry and just have a good time. I couldn't have said it better myself. Thank you very much to both of you for your time.